Hey, this is Timo from OnlineBuilderGuy.com and today we are going to be looking at HostGator Builder and the pros and cons related to that tool. Now, HostGator is actually much more than a web hosting company. They are developing this website building tool called HostGator Builder and in this video we are going to be looking at different things that you should pay attention to when you are about to choose this tool for your next project. So let's go through the pros first. Um, first thing is that uh, this setup process of a new website is a very simple and straightforward thing. So let me just go to the site creation wizard. So basically what happens is that as soon as you have registered an account with HostGator, you will see this particular page. And here you get to choose the template for your website. So let me just pick this one. And it takes a couple of seconds until the editor loads. And then it's basically your job to change the content, the images, the logo, uh, according to your brand. And once you have done these changes, it's time to publish your website. So it's really as easy as that. Very simple, very straightforward process. Um, and what's really nice about uh, especially the editor is that it's simple and easy to use. And they have this true drag and drop support. So for instance, if I choose an element, a button here, I can basically drop it anywhere on the design area. So that's really nice. And you are not necessarily going to find a true drag and drop uh, support on these other website builders out there. But HostGator Builder has this nice feature. Okay, so the setup is very simple and easy. The, the editor is easy to use. It's a very robust editor. Uh, what's also very nice about HostGator is that they are providing 24-7 providing type of support. So you have the email support. I have tested it a couple of times. It works fine. But I also love the chat support and I actually love it even more because I'm getting answers to my questions right away. And the chat support is also a 24-7 type of operation, meaning that they are supporting you any time of the day. That's really nice. Uh, yeah, that's what I wanted to talk about, the su support. Uh, I have tested it a couple of times and I have gotten answers to my questions very, very quickly without having to wait for an email uh, a response to my email ticket. Uh, so I, I definitely try to choose a provider, a website builder, which has a chat support channel. It's, it's very important. It's a very modern way to support uh, customers nowadays. Um, also, what's nice about HostGator Builder is that it's very inexpensive. So you will see these prices here, these starting prices, uh, they are based on the assumption that you are using a two-year billing cycle. Uh, so when you choose any of these plans, and I encourage you to choose the premium plan because you, you are not paying that much even if you choose a monthly billing cycle, and still you are getting a priority support option on top of these other features here. So it's definitely worth considering. But anyways, let me just click the buy now button to show you the monthly pricing for the premium plan. And um, it may be a little bit weird that uh, on the previous page you see the price in United States dollars, but here since I live in European Union country, I see the price in euros. Uh, with the two-year billing, uh, it's five, well, close to six euros per month. But if you choose the monthly billing cycle, 
even the premium uh, subscription is not that expensive. It's approximately six and a half euros per month. So it's a very inexpensive site builder. Okay, those were the pro pros of this builder, but what about the cons? Well, first of all, uh, what's really, what, what's definitely a con, at least according to me, according to my personal specs, is that you can't change the web template in the middle of the design process. This is something that you can do with other website builders, at least most of them. Like, you start building a website, and then at some point you realize that I could actually I could actually use another template for my website and this particular template that I'm currently using it's not a great fit for me anymore. I would like to change it. But unfortunately you can't do it with HostGator Builder. So you will have to stick with the with the selected template. And then you can obviously create a new website with a new template, but currently HostGator is not providing this type of flexibility where you could change the template in the middle of the design process. And I hope that they do provide this functionality at some point, but it's not possible right now. Another con is that uh, if you are thinking of building a multi-language website, then HostGator is not giving you this option. So for instance, let's say that you are building a website in English and then you decide that maybe you would like to support another uh, website. Sorry, you can't do it. At least right now you can't do it. So that's definitely a con. Then a third thing is that uh, what's nice about HostGator is that uh, they actually give you the app market where you can where you can uh, extend the functionality of your website with apps. So when you log into your website uh, or into your dashboard and click the app market here on the left, you will see these different apps that they provide. But unfortunately, it's a very limited app market, at least when you compare the selection to some, to some other website builders out there, I mean, they could have like hundreds of apps that you could choose from. I'm not saying that they are all quality apps that you could choose from, but still, uh, at, at least at this point, uh, the, uh, the selection here that you can find on the HostGator Builder app market is very, very limited. So uh, I'm really hoping that, you know, they are filling the app market with many, many more apps. Uh, and I think that it would be really great because it's a really great way to, to uh, extend your site when you have apps that someone else has developed. So please host Getter, add more apps to the app market. <laughs> and I'm much, much happier when that happens. Okay, um, those were the pros and cons that I want wanted to bring up in this video, uh, please check the HostGator Builder review by clicking the link under this video. You will find a detailed review of that tool. And uh, that's what I wanted to talk about this time. And I will get back to you with another video very soon. Bye-bye.